I've come to perceive post-truth, the word of the year 2016, as a specter that is haunting us. And with this short film, we are trying to give it some form. Perhaps most tricky about the term is the imputation that truth did exist in the past. And for responsible artists and scientists in particular, this is a paradox, since they are driven by curiosity to dig below the surface in order to gain insights that would not be apparent otherwise. So one could say that they are on a truth-searching journey that is never coming to an end. In case of the post-truth phenomenon, the underlying currents seem to be the loss of gatekeepers when it comes to distributing information. And coupled with acceleration, this can lead to fear, hatred and conflict due to uncertainty and confusion or possibilities through collaboration based on trust, courage and hope. Now it's up to us which way we're heading and through our short film we're trying to visualize that. Cogito ergo sum. I feel, therefore I am. I dream, therefore I am. I dance, therefore I am. I listen to my heart, therefore I am. I'm interconnected with everything. Therefore, we are. No single being possesses the truth. All beings possess the truth together. That is why multi-perspectivity, transdisciplinarity and holistic perception bring us closer to a possible collective truth. Acceptance of post-truth by individuals can help to avoid self-deception and deception of others on the one hand, and on the other hand, pave the way to truth from the point of view of the whole. In this sense, post-truth means before truth.